I'm going to talk you through how to mix up and apply your eyebrow tint. So you would have been sent two products. This is your colour and this is your developer. Now, it's a one-on-one -on -one mixture, one-to-one -one, as they say mixture. So use a glass container, plastic, um, ceramic, anything, but do not use metal. So all I do is just to add a blob of colour to my bowl. And when they say one to one, you just want to add the same amount of your developer. The quantities are so small, you don't really need scales, you can just do it by your eye. I don't know if you can see that. And I'm just using my eyebrow brush, just the one with the nice slant. So just mix it up. You'll notice when it is mixed enough, it goes into a nice kind of consistency. Doesn't take much time at all. Cool. So if, it, if you're just wanting to do like a light eyebrow, quite often I just brush all my hair up and I just kind of carefully paint on. Just following the shape of my eyebrow. So as you can see, I haven't applied too thickly. And if you need to clean up any bits, you can just use your cotton bud. Now you can leave that on for five, ten minutes. Now for people like me who actually do prefer a fuller brow, I apply it much thicker. And just create a much stronger shape. I also colour in a little bit more downy here underneath. Now doing this way you get a lot more um, stainage on your skin but it doesn't last for that long, maybe a day. So again just use your cotton bud just to clean up any excess bits. Okay. Now I'll try to do the other side. Now I do like my eyebrows quite dark, quite strong, so I sometimes even leave them up to 20 minutes, half an hour. Don't forget, always set a timer. I have forgotten in the past. Usually remember when I go to rub my face and rub tint everywhere. Now if you do feel nervous about doing this, even if you just leave it on for five minutes, rinse it off and you can just reapply. Great if you've got a few sort of stubborn greys. Haven't done this side anywhere as well as the other side. And as you can see as the colour is developing, you can kind of see where you've missed spots. Cool. So there you go. And I'll let that process. 
And just to rinse it off, all you need to do is get, I just get some paper towels, wet them, and then just wipe off. It's as easy as that.